Tall Tale TV. The Future of Society by Shifty Saul. They say that a human life is invaluable, that you can't put a price tag on it. After China introduced the social credit rating system, it soon spread to the rest of the world. No one thought of it as a problem until it made its way into the healthcare systems. Because of the strain and lack of funds in what was essentially a human need, it became the norm to base your patient's necessity for treatment on this rating. It started off getting lower ratings because of your general health, obesity, alcoholism, if you smoked. People thought this was fair. If someone didn't look after themselves, then why would they deserve treatment over someone else who was more healthy? It became worse when the rating system took advantage of its social aspect. The population could vote you up or down, depending on how you were as a person. It became a must to be perceived as popular. Everyone shied away from any controversial political thinking or acts of anything scandalous, and tried to better themselves to increase their stars. Humanity bettered as a whole, but lost what the idea of being human really means. And the government swayed people's perception on people, lowering the rating of anyone who opposed them. But you couldn't be off the grid. Anyone without a smartphone or who hadn't downloaded the app would automatically show up as a zero. The homeless and poor were the first to feel the impact as their lack of funds forced them into a calling, for lack of a better word. Any sufferers of diabetes, asthma, or any condition that requires constant medication now had no access to their rights for treatment. When visiting a hospital, the higher rated were treated first, and sometimes the lower rated weren't treated at all. With the massive decrease in population of the working class, society began to crumble. Threats to vote people down to force them to take the roles of minimum paid jobs stabilized humanity for a time. But this vicious cycle of spite and revenge became worse and worse. We enter a period of time where the eggshells that we so tentatively walk on cover the graves of everyone in our wake. Unable to show any inclining of individuality, any political bias, and thought that could be seen as a disregard or judgment on our government oppressors, lest we suffer the same fate. With this, I ask you, what would you rate another human's life? Hey guys, I want to thank Shifty Saul for letting me narrate this story. I came across it while browsing Reddit, and as a diabetic myself, this take on Xi Jinping's facial recognition and social credit systems really hit home. I'd seen several stories inspired by the same recent headlines of China's plans, but never one that touched on the healthcare aspect. If you like this story, be sure to subscribe for more sci-fi and fantasy, or sign up for my weekly newsletter at talltaletv.com. I'm Chris Heron, and that's it for today's Tall Tale TV.